Well, hello there, everybody. Dre here, and welcome back to my humble garage. We're moving up in the world, and in the last episode, we bought this beautiful beast. Well, today, hopefully, I'm going to uh, fully restore this thing into uh, perfect working order, because right now, it's, it's good. We improved it quite a bit, but there still needs to be some parts I need to buy, so I did a bunch off recording as per usual. We now have uh, almost 19k in the bank. I also unlocked uh, some more perks just to keep you guys updated. So yeah, essentially just screwing speed and mounting speed to make these jobs a little bit quicker. And yeah, we're nearing level 15, which is an exciting level because that unlocks the car auctions, which would obviously be great. That's our last major unlock. So hopefully we can get to that today. Uh, but yeah, what I really wanted to focus on right away was fully restoring this thing. So I'm going to buy some new upgrades. Uh, now that we have a little bit of money in the bank, we should be okay to upgrade that car and buy some upgrades as well. One thing I really want that's dirt cheap is the warehouse. So we're going to buy that. That's going to allow us to store and organize parts, I believe, which is great considering we're going to start scrapping cars. Keeping my inventory organized is going to be very difficult without that. Would love to get paint shop, but it is not cheap in this game. Dino and test path as well, all obviously all very expensive. So we'll get those later. We'll get the welder now. So that's for full body repairs. I guess we could get... No, you know what? Let's just keep that. All the engine stand does is allow me to swap whole engines, which would be great, but I don't really need it right now. I should probably buy the tablet at this point just because it's so cheap. Ooh, look, I can I, I, I can, I can go to my computer anywhere. That's actually kind of nice. I should have bought that long, a long time ago. Okay, but yeah, here is... Whoa, where... How do I get to there? What the hell? Where, where the hell is that? How the hell do I get in there? Oh, is it out here? No, what? How do I get in my room? Wait. I don't understand. <laughs> oh, this door does open. Okay, so we have the warehouse now. Oh, I have a case that I forgot to open. Okay, we'll open that. Give me more barns. I need barns. Or XP. I'll go actually, did that just level me up? Oh my god, that's a major XP. <laughs> Talk about lucky. We actually just hit level 15 already. So we'll definitely be able to check out the auction house today. So I don't know how this works. Is it just one big inventory? I was hoping I could like make it into folders for each car, but we'll check that out later. We also have the welder now. Let's just see. How does this work? Use equipment. Sure you want to repair bolt to Glana. Yeah, you know what? I don't know what I just did. I'm assuming that reinforces the frame. Okay, so cool. Um, I'm assuming we're going to get jobs that make us do that now, which is what I really wanted to do. Okay, so now we are going to start upgrading this thing, though. This is really what I wanted to focus on today, because this should give us a lot of money if we can fully restore this thing. So first thing I want to do is take off the body panels and just see and make sure that these things are good. They look good, but I want to obviously check them out okay and yeah conditions are pretty good all things considered but can definitely be improved so we have the tools to do it we may as well make this perfect so let's reassemble it real quick and then we got to start working on the internals a little bit more uh there's still a lot of things we need to change on this i also need to still buy a headlight so hopefully we can find that did that say 96 percent I, I guess I didn't repair that that's fine actually you know what that's not fine I want to make sure we get everything 100% on this so yeah there's a few things we're going to need to buy uh we basically need all the interior even like license plates and everything they're good but I'm trying to get this up max 100% for everything and as you can see a lot more green showing up but uh, we still have about half actually what, what page did we hit six yeah we have literally half of the car still needs a little bit of work all right, so we have a body workstation. I'm going to buy two lights. So that's done. I didn't check the back tail lights, but I'm assuming, yeah, we're going to need to buy those as well. They're good. <laughs> They're just not good enough for me. I'm going to need new glass all the way around. That's not cheap. God, I hope we have enough money to do this because I haven't even gotten into the mechanicals yet. All right, we need new seats. Oh, perfect. The steering wheel's there too. So it looks like we don't have much of a selection. Um, Jesus. These are so expensive. So you get a seat and you get a seat all shiny and new. There's your new steering wheel. We'll sell the rest of this stuff just because we can. And now we're going to have to go back into the internals here. There's quite a bit we still need to fix. It's cleaner than what it was when we first saw it. But yeah, as you can see, I'm going to need a bunch of stuff here. Looks like I'm going to need eight rocker arms. Is the other side just as bad? Okay, let's just buy, buy 16 just for the fun of it. Oh, God damn it. These push rods are bad, too. Every one of the... You know what? I'm just going to buy 16 of those, too. 
Oh yeah, that's right. I freaking leveled up. I totally forgot. We we can go so much faster now. Let's uh, do this before I forget. So we'll get fast hands. Oh, I only have four skill points available. I swear I got more for level 14. You know what? I think I'm going to get the discount instead. I think that's smarter. I like that, that we can actually unlock higher tiers of the things. We don't have to buy like parking, for example. Ooh, this is cool. Gives you the ability to inspect the value of a car. That's going to be great considering we're getting into car buying now. We'll probably buy that once we level up next. All right, we also need the exhaust manifold. That's going to be a big purchase. I mean, pretty much everything down here is pretty bad. Let's just lift the car. We're going to need to anyways. I doubt I can, but I'm going to try and separate the wheels to see if I can repair these rims. Exhaust pipe. We need the whole exhaust. We'll buy the things that aren't added to the car after we repair everything that uh, can be repaired. Oil pan. I don't think there's oil in it. Yeah, no, because I just put this back on, so we should be okay. All right, I changed the bushings, right? Yeah, bushings are good. Oh, crankshaft pulley needs to be repaired. Oh, man. How did I leave this stuff in here? What What, what a freaking rookie. I, I knew about this. Okay, is that everything? Everything else I'm pretty sure I repaired. Again, all the internals should be good, assuming I didn't somehow screw up. So, yeah, that's looking... God, I wish this view was a little bit better. It's pretty tight in here. Maybe I should have bought the engine lift. Oh, you know what? I probably didn't change the spark plugs, did I? No. Okay, we're going to add eight of those. Okay, and actually, I changed all the suspension over here. So, aside from wheels, and did I change... I took out the filter. I guess it never had a filter, actually. Yeah, aside from wheels, I think we're pretty much good now. I'm sure we forgot something, but we should see it on the list once we repair all this stuff. Hopefully, I can repair this. Did I get those bushings? Yes, I did. Okay, sick. Oh, almost missed a wheel hub cap. Don't want to miss that. Actually, the bearings. I didn't think I checked those, did I? We might need those all, all the way around. Oh, sick. I can actually do all of them. That's huge because rims, I'm assuming, will not be the cheapest. Ah, oh, this is why I bought this bench and used so much of my perk points into it. This is truly fantastic for this type of stuff. There we go. Definitely going to need new tires, though. So are they all the same width? Yeah, they are. Uh, I got to remember that it doesn't change the width in the, in the store. So let's just go to the store right now and buy those. All right, there we go. 215, 70R15. I'm going to need four of those bad boys. Actually, not as much as I thought it would be. So that's good. And now we just have a big list of everything else that we need to buy, which is quite a bit, as you can see. All right, actually, I, did, I thought I'd spend way more money. So I'm definitely not worried. We should be able to fully finish this thing because I doubt there's going to be much left. And we still got 7,000 in the bank. All right, so we're going to reassemble the wheels as well as shocks. And uh, yeah, I'm excited. We're getting near the end of this. And it's going to look so good with all 100%. Okay, there we go. Those are looking so clean. Of course, we got to balance the tires as well as responsible mechanics. I think that's all of them. So now the fun part of assembling this and praying that I didn't forget anything. Wish I bought this before, man. This is great. I can just buy on the fly. Was it ordinary or small? I don't know. Worst case, I'll just buy the other ones. But yeah, I don't even need to move from the, like, build menu. I forgot a couple bushings, obviously. I'm gonna forget a few things. I've already saw that I forgot the radiator fan. As well as a few other things. But hey, the majority of the stuff's going on just fine. Get that muffler set up. Finally, we actually have a muffler on this thing. Brand new shocks. Alright, it's finally starting to come together. All the tires are done. Don't know what else I'm possibly missing. Uh, I do know, like I said, the radiator fan. Oh, yeah. Do I have a fuel pump? No. Okay, so I'm going to have to add the shopping list. And yeah, as I said, this this tablet's amazing. Let's look at that. We can just buy it right now. I don't even need to move. And we can install it. Perfect. And to buy some new ignition wires as well. Oh, yeah. All the freaking valve push rods. And then we're going to need a cover for this as well. I haven't gotten that far. Oh, my God. I forgot all these. The rocker arms as well. All right, yeah, as I assumed, I need a cover. I'm assuming I need A and B. I'll just buy one at a time. I think that's it for the engine. After I get the other side done, of course. Just bought the fan as well. Okay, but I think that's it. No, never mind. I can actually see I'm missing a bushing right now. <laughs> Should probably put that in there. Okay, we're gonna need to buy more of those. What the? How did I miss a bushing? Probably means I'm missing the other sides too. I should have just bought more of them. They're so cheap, but... God damn it, it's always bushings. No, that one... How did I lose a bushing? I'm very confused by that. Okay, I really wish I could zoom out a bit more, but I think that should be everything. We can always inspect it here. Hopefully, we see mostly green. 
It's all freaking green. Okay, may maybe not. Kind of forgot about fuses, it looks like. Then we got clips for the fuses, relay. So it's all fuse related. How did I forget about the whole fuse box? <laughs> all right, but if all I missed was fuses, that's not bad. I think we got everything after this. Okay, and is that freaking it? Did I actually do it? Will this car run now? Oh yeah, I, I, I need clips, don't I? Do, do I need clips? Where the hell do I need the clips for? I thought it would be for the fuse box. Doesn't look like there's clips there. I, I know it said I needed some. Yeah, clip B and clip B. Where, where the freaking the clips go? Oh, wait. I'm 57% small rubber. Bu uh oh. Of all things, a bushing is not perfect. That's going to be hard to freaking find. Wait, can I, I? I can actually highlight it. Oh, God. That's amazing. Also, the clips we can highlight. I forgot that we can do that. That's great. Let me just go through this list. I thought it would be in order of uh, quality, but clearly with that 54% in the random middle there. Let's just make sure. No, we have maxed out this car once we get these few things done. So where the hell did those clips go though? Oh, on this thingy. Okay. I think I actually have those clips already if I remember correctly. Yeah, I do. Okay. So all I need is that little bushing wherever that is. Where are you bushing? Oh, there you are in the back. Okay. <laughs> the final piece a boring bushing. And there we go. We're officially pretty much broke, but hey, we have a perfect, literally perfect car. Oh, that feel. Oh, actually, we should probably do liquids too. That would be smart. Oh, but that was so much more rewarding than uh, just doing the odd repair job. There's something fascinating about getting an old crap car and making it perfect. Let's just check the dipstick. And then, of course, we got to test run this thing. Make sure it's actually working well. Oh, yeah. Listen to it. Listen to it. Oh, oh this feels so great. I mean, it's probably not going to go get any records. Hell, it can hardly turn on the first turn. But at least it looks good doing it. Okay, just 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 testing it out. Just testing it out. That's all. Oh my god. This understeer is insane I'm destroying my own car more than anything else. I've driven. All right. Well, it drove like a boat But god damn it. That's exactly. Oh god. That's exactly what I expected to happen I was steering while I was braking and it was just going straight I love it though. That's exactly what I wanted and uh, yeah, I guess now it's time to sell it Oh, I really don't want to sell it because it's my first but obviously I need the money. I could use the money for sure. So Yeah, we'll put it to good use. I haven't even looked at how much it's worth now That's what I'm talking about a profit of 32,000 credits now we're talking about it. I don't feel so bad selling it anymore I spent a lot of time building that thing but god damn it, there we go. We are making money, man. Oh, that was freaking hard to do, though. But yeah, let's sell the rest of this stuff. I'll start storing anything that's 100% now that we have the warehouse. But obviously, none of this is going to be 100%. Okay, so now I guess we'll go check out the car auctions. Uh, maybe we can buy something there that uh, looks good. Because, yeah, I want to get more cars now, obviously. All right, uh, we have car auctions and salvage cars. I guess we'll just try car. Okay, so oh cool. Okay, so we can go to both So what i'm getting at is that these are probably crappers. I don't know what the rating means Is that the quality of the car? Is that the rating of the deal? It doesn't really explain much does it also this el camino says trespasser. Oh express. I don't know Wait, what, what, what qp what are the four-wheel drive turbo? All right, let's just go to the ordinary car auctions is this so this is for if you're buying something that i'm assuming is in pretty good condition and we can just go look at it okay i think i think we can yes okay this is actually really cool uh i i was a little underwhelmed with the junkyard but you can actually inspect these and it looks like i'm not sure what the difference is between the car auctions and the junkers because this one obviously it's nice but it's not great i mean there's not much to go on right now can i use my tools on these cars no all i can do is examine and i guess we we could do that I mean, yeah, essentially, if I wanted to upgrade this thing to a good amount, I'm going to have to change everything. It's all about 50 to 60%. So that's enough information for me. I just want to see how this works. So I'm going to bid at 1,200. Bidder for... Whoa, 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 relax. Uh, yeah, I'm not in love with this that much. So I'm just going to give up. Okay, that's cool, though. Okay, so I, I was worried I'd have to go back to my garage after that. But no, we, we can bid on all these. I think I'm more of a, of a salvage car type guy. I want to get something that's real bad because I plan on doing the 100% thing again. 
Ooh, tempting. This would be really cool to repair. I mean, oh my god, is it ever... Okay, I understand the difference now. This thing is, uh... God, would I even be able to buy these parts in the, in the ordinary store? I doubt it, honestly. There's not even a freaking engine in it! I mean, I'll bid 450 just because I want to get out of here. But yeah, I'm just going to give up. This is so cool. All right. You know what? I don't hate this 69 Mustang. This is uh, pretty clean on the outside. I think this would be a good car to... Oh, wow. Wow. I'm actually impressed. Even if we were to uh, not max this thing out, I think we could probably earn quite a bit of money on this. The problem is, I don't know how much it's worth, though. So I don't know how much I should go for. I don't want to waste a lot of my money, but you know what? I'm 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 willing to do it. All right, 15. I'm going to try 19. Oh, my God. 22. Oh. Oh, I don't... I do it. I'm doing it. Oh, you bastards. All right. All right. Oh, please, God. Stop. Stop. I want to win it. I think, I think I'm done. I think I'm done. I can. I, I don't, th I don't think that would have been a good deal. God damn it. I really wanted that too. I just don't want to put all my money in something that I don't know much about. What about the, this gold trail? Oh man, that is freaking sleek. Okay. Now that I've seen it, I, I want it that much more. All right. Come on. Stop. 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 Please, please don't. Oh, I have to go one more. That's it. I'm done after this. Bidder four, I hate you so much. I can't, I can't comfortably bid over 30,000 for a car. I don't know why, I just can't do it. What if we go for something that needs some TLC? I gotta say, I love the look of this thing. Um, obviously this one's nowhere near as good as the last ones. Yeah, this is, this is definitely a good fixer-upper though. So I think, you know what? I think this is truly speaking to me and I don't think the bidding's gonna go insane. Please, like, you give me it for like 20. I'd be so happy with 20. Huh? Huh? Oh, they're slowing down. Hold on. Come Stop. All right, hold on. Str strategy. We have to wait. Dude, you guys are the freaking worst. Come on. Come on! Why are we bidding against each other so much? Please, 20. I need... I need Dude, are you serious? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh, I don't know if I want that for 22, honestly. <laughs> I, I, I kind of got in the moment there. Well, I guess we receive it now. Um, I'm gonna throw that at the garage. Should I keep going? Should I buy a crapper too? Oh man, I just, I, I can't comfortably buy these things. This is truly awful. Maybe we should use the barn finds instead. I feel like the barn finds is a better option. So yeah, you know what? I don't want to spend any more money here. I'm just gonna leave. And let's see how much I screwed up buying this truck. Oh God, it's gonna look so good when it's done though. I honestly don't even care if I lost a crap load of money. Hey, it's actually, I mean, just like last time, I think I was 1,000 credits b before in the, in the negative. This isn't as bad as I thought. So once we actually uh, repair this and whatnot, we should definitely earn some money on it. All right, guys. But on that, we're going to wrap up this episode here. I hope you guys enjoyed experiencing the first little bit of auctions today. I got to say, I think I did a pretty good purchase here. There's something about an old truck with white walls that just excites me. So yeah, I'm excited to upgrade this thing. I'll be doing that in the next one and probably doing a bunch more as well because uh, we should be able to flip these things pretty quickly now. As always, thanks for watching and liking, guys. And I'll see you in the next one.